Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Mainz against Borussia Dortmund. Thanks Derek. Well often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing. But so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, Marco Reus, usually a potential match winner. Stuart, what are your expectations regarding his performance today? Well, Derek, I'm sure he's going to score another goal today because he's got four in the last three games. He's a player full of confidence, and every time he makes a forward run, he looks as though he's going to get in behind. He's in outstanding form at the moment. as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five but I think the wing backs will have license to get forward at every opportunity and also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two and introducing the Borussia Dortmund side Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence Julian Brandt plays alongside Mahmoud Dahoud in the centre of the pitch and the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland And so the battle commences. And an astute piece of defending. strong and secure on the ball and that puts them in position and running in behind well not making life difficult for the keeper at all a wide attempt Dahoud. The ball with Marco Reus. A sloppy pass. Top class defending. They've lost it. Well, high marks for that pass. It needs an accurate cross. And good pressure high up the pitch. And they're trying to get right into his face. Great pressure to win the ball back. Sylvain Wittner. Couldn't quite find his teammate. And Borussia Dortmund in a position of menace. But they took care of the situation defensively. Karim Onisibo. Playing with purpose and control. Good work to regain possession. Marco Reus. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Holland. Spot on with that tackle.
Daniel Malin. And they deal with the threat this time. And providing width. Teammates in the middle. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Can they get in behind them? But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Good pick out of teammates. That's a routine take. Dahoud. Now with Bellingham. Moving into the advanced position. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Oh, great vision. Marco Royce, does he mean business here? And the danger's still on. Keeper getting the touch. Just cutting off the supply. Van Wiedmer. The cross is on. Chance, maybe. It looks promising. He might yet finish. Oh, poor ball, and easy for the keeper. Failure to keep the ball on the part of Dahoud. And unable to pick out a teammate, and that'll be a throw. Dahoud. He's given us away. And a throw in forthcoming. Lee J. Sung. No possibilities in the centre. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Martin. Karim Onisibo. They've regained possession. Well, as you can see, it's been really tight, and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Hopefully that will change soon, and then we might get some entertainment. Lee Jae Sung. And there to intervene. Minier. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. Guerrero. He got in the way of that cross. He read it well. And space to attack. He's in with a chance. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Marco Weiss. Meunier. And a decent delivery. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Olisibo. Cut 
And there it is, the half-time whistle. And so the battle commences. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Might be able to produce from this position. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. They've won back possession. And a long way out. Well, a powerful effort, but just wide. with Guerrero it's a good Dortmund move in the making oh surely and saved by the keeper well you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point because they're really looking dangerous at the moment Guerrero and now Dahoud really needed to be spot on with the challenge inside the box well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Not a very good challenge, and he skips past his man. The cross is on. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Sylvain Widmer crossing possibilities but dealt with efficiently and cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick well this is a big moment and don't these fans know it well that was never likely to trouble the keeper well this has to get better because as those stats confirm the attacking play from both sides just hasn't been good enough it's all been a little bit too cautious so far cross well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance and so 30 minutes left for play in this one they've given it away Hummers well, they couldn't keep possession Deserves credit for winning the ball back. And Bellingham. Can they forge ahead? Well read to put an end to that attack. They're making high pressing work for them here. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? Well, he's going to be taking no further part in this match. Well, it's not a clever challenge, is it? We're going to have to dig in now. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. And the attacking options appear plentiful but quick thinking defensively.
Good defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, that pass easy on the eye. Real chance. Keeper did his job to begin with. Really vital interception here. It's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Along well, you go, says the referee. Advantage. Dangerous looking through ball. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. And a chance for him on the flank. But they took care of the situation defensively. Giving the ball away. And this is Royce. And with that, the attack fizzles out. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Karim Onisibo. And giving the ball away. Emre Can. Not showing good vision. They've lost it. Sylvain Wigmer. Level pegging, but can they change that? Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. And they're making a change. The referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, that header was never going to be problematic for the goalkeeper. And the danger clear. Emre Can. It might be on for them. Clearance wasn't decisive. And they'd be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, that's one for them to pursue. He just needs to keep a cool head. They were playing fluid football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. get the header on the target but you've got to give credit to the defending Holland and they'll be happy to have regained possession he's lost it this might be ideal for the counter with a minute sticking away. Oh, just cutting off the supply. Really getting stuck in. Is that 
after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up.